Welcome students to our introduction video about online sources. Today, we have four goals for our learning. Number one, we will learn how to use Symbaloo. Number two, we will learn how to use Encyclopedia Britannica. Number three, we will learn how to find nonfiction books on Epic. And number four, we will learn how to show what we have learned about a person or animal. First, we're going to talk about a couple of vocabulary words that we want to make sure that everybody understands. The first one is research. That's what we're going to be doing today with these online sources. We are going to be doing research. Research is a way of looking for new information, understanding, and facts. An encyclopedia. An encyclopedia is a set of books or a website that has information on a wide variety of subjects. When Mrs. Brooks was a kid, we only had encyclopedias that were books that we could look up information in. Today, we are going to be going to a website or database that is online that has that same information that was in the books. And then finally, a biography. A biography is an article or a book about a person. This is a Symbaloo. A Symbaloo is simply a collection of websites put together in an easy uh, format so that we can get to the places we need to go. So in another video, we'll explain more about how to use the symbol. Encyclopedia Britannica is the online encyclopedia that we will be using today to find information. And then finally, Epic. Most of you are familiar with Epic. We'll be using Epic today to look for nonfiction books. And our class code is on this slide if you need it. So the research we are going to do today, I will show you how to look for information about a person, which is a biography, and find information about an animal. And then at the end, you will choose either a person or animal to research. So we will do practice and show what we know. After you watch the lesson videos, you'll make a Google slide to show what you have learned about a person or animal. You'll get to pick one, and then you'll take a 10 question quiz. I'll show you my example. I love tigers, so I looked up information about tigers, and this is my Google slide. There will be another video that will explain to you exactly how you're gonna do that assignment. Now go back to Google Classroom and watch the rest of the lesson videos in the Learn section.